Lucas Media. So we got some news coming out of basketball world. Bronny James clearly looks like he's going to stay in the NBA draft. However, his agent, Rich Paul, a.k.a. Clutch Sports, a.k.a. I run the NBA, um, has came out and said some interesting things about Bronny. Now, Bronny is projected to be a second round overall pick. I've seen him go 54 to... Was it Dallas? One of them teams. And then I've seen him 55 to the Lakers. Um, but now we also know that Bron, or LeBron, LeBron James Sr. has or is going to test the free agent market per his agent Rich Paul as well. Bronny and LeBron is with Rich Paul. Rich Paul's been on a, uh, with LeBron for over 20 plus years, so on and so forth, right? Well, most people thought that Bronny would be drafted on a two-way contract, you know, where he played uh, several games and then play in the G League and get more experience. Rich Paul said that that's not happening. He came out and said, quote, yes, that's absolutely true. Teams know I'm not doing that. And he's talking about Bronny signing a two-way contract. So he's looking for Bronny to sign a, a strictly NBA contract. Now, now, th now this is really getting interesting because will this be a Bronny moving up to the first round? Or this is a second round? And then I believe second round players, their contracts are not guaranteed. Is Rich Paul going to have Bronny's guaranteed? But if, if anybody... If anybody could do it, it would definitely be Rich Paul. I could see Bronny. Wouldn't it be wild if the Lakers draft Bronny and then LeBron don't even stay? He goes to Cleveland or whatever. But I do think that Rich Paul is going to be able to get away with it. He has so much power. You know, and if teams don't do what he says, that can affect other players. You know, you look at all the top guys, Rich Paul got them. So I won't be surprised if he's able to get away with a second round pick not getting a two-way deal unless Bronny moves up in the rankings and still gets a uh, sec first round pick because I did I have seen where he had a private lake workout with the Lakers and a private workout with the Suns and even though LeBron said that he doesn't LeBron Bronny or LeBron Jr. going to Lakers is not guaranteed like that's not what he's looking for don't be surprised that behind the scenes, Rich Paul is telling certain teams, don't you draft Bronny, because if you do, there's going to be consequences and repercussions. But I just want to give my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.